Harry, the weekly Halfway ceremony is about to start. Follow me and I'll show you where it is. Dumbledore, Headmaster of Hogwarts. Welcome to the very first weekly house point ceremony of the school year. The house with the most points wins a visit to the Bean Bonus Room. The length of the visit depends on how many more points they have over the second placed house. Let's take a look at the scores. Oh, it appears that Gryffindor is in the lead. Harry, it looks like you get to visit the bonus beam room. Good luck, and remember, you only have a limited time to collect beans. Harry, there you are. Glad I found you. Hello, Wood. Time for Quidditch practice, Harry. None of the other teams have started training yet, so we'll have a good head start. But I haven't had lunch yet. You can eat later. Follow me to the Quidditch pitch. Would you be 
interested in trading? Hey, Harry, want to trade? We buy in bulk and pass the savings on to you. Good old Hagrid's hut. Listen up, Harry. We're going to make sure we win the Quidditch Cup this year, and the way we're going to do that is practice, practice, practice. First, a quick recap of what we learned last year. Of course, you already know that the red ball is called the Quaffle, and it's the job of the three chasers to get it past the enemy keeper and into one of the goalposts. But you don't need to concern yourself with that. There are also two bludgers flying around, which you don't want to get hit by. But don't worry, each team has two beaters who try to keep them away from you. Last, and most importantly, it's your job as our Seeker to catch the Golden Snitch before the enemy Seeker does. Since you've been off all summer, let's start out easy. I'm going to throw up a Snitch for you, and I want you to try to catch it. Sounds easy enough? your arrow keys to steer your broom left, right, up and down. Being hit by a bludger, pushed by the other seeker or running into things can slow you down and put you further behind the snitch. You'll automatically close in on the snitch. Press the left mouse button to catch the snitch. Now the rest of the Gryffindor team is here, let's play a mock game of Quidditch. Avoid the bludgers and the other Seeker. I'm going to have a Gryffindor stand in as an enemy Seeker. You'll need to make sure she's out of the way before you can catch the Snitch. Don't worry, they'll take it easy on you. Excellent work, everyone. You're back on form, Potter, which means we've got a great chance of winning the cup this year. Aren't you finished yet, Harry? Don't look now, but here comes the Slytherin team. I don't believe it! I booked the pitch for today. Hey! They've got new brooms and, and it looks like... Yes, they are! They're Nimbus 2001s! Yeah, I know. Apparently, Lucius Malfoy made a very generous donation. Like our new brooms, Weasley. What are you doing here, Malfoy? I'm the Slytherin Seeker now. Didn't you know? Perhaps someday Gryffindor will be able to afford new brooms. Well, at least no one on the Gryffindor team had to buy their way in. They got in on pure talent. No one asked your opinion, you filthy little 
mudblood. You pay for that one now, Foy. Well, at least I could afford it, Weasley, unlike you. Leave it, Ron. He's not worth the trouble. Mudblood, the nasty name some wizards use for other wizards who were born to non-magical parents. And speaking of mud, October arrived damply at Hogwarts, spreading a soggy chill over the grounds and into the castle. A different kind of chill would soon set in as well.